Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to let any of the in place walk to follow the path like this. Now you can see this this one is the catwalk loop. Okay? It is in place walk but now it follow the path. The original animation it is just like this one. Just walk in place. How to make sure the in place walk to follow the path to walk. So start from now, I'm going to show you all the step by step. First, I'm going to just start all over again, start everything. This is the animation that I want. This is the catwalk loop. I'm going to start from creating a 3D avatar. All right, I may just choose this girl. All right, next. Next, I go to the motions. I find the in-place walk just now. All right, it is under here. The in-place walk. Now, you can see this is just walk in place this is just an animation so next is to create a path just create a path then just click click anywhere that you want this avatar to walk until until you feel satisfied click the last one then press escape now this is the path to follow you can see this is the path if you want to move the path you still can just double click it Press Q, double click, and you can move the location like this. So as demo, I'm going to just let her to just walk, follow this path. Now you try to play, this is just an in-place walk. So now, back to the zero frame. First, just double click it, and then, once you're ready, double click the avatar, select it, then go to here, then scroll up and down until you can see the path. This path, click to select the path. Then, next, just just try to play. You can see it is still not follow the path. You still need to set up one more thing. That is, just make sure under this, double click. You need to make sure you follow the path and follow negative y axis, the minus y axis, in this way. Now, if you try to play, you can see it is still not following. That means you need to adjust the timeline. And this is if this is the last frame, you need to make sure it is at 100. So now we try again. You can see it already followed the path, but the step is not yet follow. The step is stopping there. We need to go to the animations at here. Go to the timeline, and you can see this is the walk loop. You need to make sure you duplicate until the keyframe where the last frame stop at. Now we try to play again. Try to play. Now we can see she already follow, but you can see the foot still sliding. So this one we can change the last frame to be further. Then keep on duplicate further. It will slow down the steps. Now you can see for this time the walk will be more normal. It is still a little bit of sliding. Then you can adjust this. Right again. Try again. For this time it is going more normal. So just by adjusting the last frame you can just avoid the sliding and for each of the point you better just make it almost the same distance for every path all right that's all for today about my tutorials on how to let the in place walk to follow the path to go to any directions something like this let the character follow the path to walk in place you can apply any in place animations and let it follow. Alright, that's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you love my videos, tutorials on 3D modeling, 3D animations, and 3D game developing, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all so that when next time I publish a new tutorials or sharings, you receive the notification immediately. See you in my next video. Enjoy. Happy 3D modeling, 3D animations, and 3D game developing. See you.